Hurricane Gonzalo was the second tropical cyclone, after Hurricane Fay, to directly strike the island of Bermuda in a one-week time frame in October 2014, and was the first Category 4 Atlantic hurricane since Hurricane Ophelia in 2011. At the time, it was the strongest hurricane in the Atlantic since Igor in 2010. Gonzalo struck Bermuda less than a week after the surprisingly fierce Hurricane Fay. 2014 was the first season in recorded history to feature two hurricane landfalls in Bermuda. A powerful Atlantic tropical cyclone that wrought destruction in the Leeward Islands and Bermuda, Gonzalo was the seventh named storm, sixth and final hurricane and only the second major hurricane of the below average 2014 Atlantic hurricane season. The storm formed from a tropical wave on October 12th, while located east of the Lesser Antilles. It made landfall on Antigua, St. Martin, and Anguilla as a Category 1 hurricane, causing damage on those and nearby islands. Antigua and Barbuda sustained 40 million US dollars in losses, and boats were abundantly damaged or destroyed throughout the northern Leeward Islands. The storm killed three people on St. Martin and St. Barthélemy. Gonzalo tracked northwestward as it intensified into a major hurricane. Eye wall replacement cycles led to fluctuations in the hurricane's structure and intensity, but on October 16, Gonzalo peaked with maximum sustained winds of 145 miles per hour, 230 kilometers per hour. Hurricane Irma was an extremely powerful Cape Verde hurricane that caused widespread destruction across its path in September 2017. Irma was the first Category 5 hurricane to strike the Leeward Islands on record, followed by Maria two weeks later. At the time, it was considered as the most powerful hurricane on record in the open Atlantic region, outside of the Caribbean Sea and Gulf of Mexico until it was surpassed by Hurricane Dorian two years later. It was also the third strongest Atlantic hurricane at landfall ever recorded, just behind the 1935 Labor Day hurricane and Hurricane Dorian. Welcome to my presentation about the NFL. The NFL was formed in 1920 as the American Professional Football Association APFA, before renaming itself the National Football League for the 1922 season. After initially determining champions through ends-of-season standings, a playoff system was implemented in 1933 that culminated with the NFL championship game until 1966. Following an agreement to merge the NFL with the American Football League AFL, the Super Bowl was first held in 1967 to determine a champion between the best teams from the two leagues and has remained as the final game of each NFL season since the merger was completed in 1970. Today, the NFL has the highest average attendance, 67,591, of any professional sports league in the world and is the most popular sports league in the United States. The Super Bowl is also among the biggest club sporting events in the world with the individual games accounting for many of the most watched television programs in American history and all occupying the Nielsen's top 5 tally of the all-time most watched US television broadcasts by 2015. The Green Bay Packers hold the most combined NFL championships with 13, winning 9 titles before the Super Bowl era and 4 Super Bowls afterwards. Since the creation of the Super Bowl, the Pittsburgh Steelers and New England Patriots both have the most championship titles at 6. Various types of tornadoes include the multiple vortex tornado, land spout, and water spout. Water spouts are characterized by a spiraling funnel-shaped wind current, connecting to a large cumulus or cumulonimbus cloud. They are generally classified as non-supercellular tornadoes that develop over bodies of water, but there is disagreement over whether to classify them as true tornadoes. These spiraling columns of air frequently develop in tropical areas close to the equator and are less common at high latitudes. Cyclone Kyrill slash single quote Kyrill slash was a low pressure area that evolved into an unusually violent European windstorm, forming an extratropical cyclone with hurricane strength winds. It formed over Newfoundland on the 15th of January 2007 and moved across the Atlantic Ocean reaching Ireland and Great Britain by the evening of the 17th of January. The storm then crossed the North Sea on 17 and the 18th of January, making landfall on the German and Dutch coasts on the afternoon of the 18th of January, before moving eastwards toward Poland and the Baltic Sea on the night from 18 to the 19th of January and further on to northern Russia.